okay so we go to files and folders click this pc you can see there's only one drive that exists here we minimize this now i'm gonna show you how to create a virtual drive so we head straight to settings in the settings we go to options we come to system from the system we scroll we'll find storage we click on it we scroll again we we'll find advanced storage settings we we'll click on that we select disks and volumes click on it now we can see from here create vhd we click on that and our name in this context will be j and j explores all right so browse to select the location so this pc and we select osc you can now click select folder now the virtual hard disk size we know 1024 gigabyte is equivalent to one terabyte so that's how we are gonna do it so i change it to gigabyte and make it 1024 because we just need one terabyte for this example now we see vhd supports virtual disk up to 2040 gigabytes in size whilst vda supports a maximum of 64 terabytes and is resilient to power failures virtual hard disk type fixed size is recommended dynamically expanding so as the name goes fixed size means everything is fixed dynamically expanding means it changes over time or it varies so we select vds and create now from the initialize this part we select master boot record for this example and now i'll click on initialize now our label g and js plus as we did earlier on for the drive letter i'll select g since our name go with g now ntfs has been selected by default we can format it and now boom we have our drive created successfully so you can see this pc is there and we have two drives properties if you look at the properties you are gonna see we have use space and free space available there which means the drive has been created successfully okay so let's go back to the home all right just follow for more tips